start the scan from the occlusal surface with the tip of the scanner pointing towards the distal. On the interiors, rotate back and forth from the palatal to the facial. It is important to capture data on all three surfaces. Scan the occlusal surface of the entire arch. Next, scan all of the buckle. The scan should continue from the occlusal surface already scanned and overlap with it. Scan all of the palatal. The scan should continue from the occlusal surface already scanned and overlap with it. Start scanning on the same side as with the upper arch. Start from the occlusal surface with the tip of the scanner pointing towards the distal. On the interiors, rotate back and forth from the lingual to the facial. It is important to capture data on all three surfaces. Scan the occlusal of the entire arch. Scan all of the buckle. The scan should continue from the occlusal surface already scanned and overlap with it. Scan all of the lingual. The scan should continue from the occlusal surface already scanned and overlap with it. Continue to scanning the teeth in occlusion. Start the scan from the same side as the previous scans. Start with the buccal surface of the upper molars. Hold the scanner still and capture the teeth until you hear a sound signal. 
and the previously scanned upper model appears on the screen. Next, capture the lower models on the same side until the previously scanned lower model appears. If necessary, the models can also be aligned manually. Move on to buckle 2 and repeat the buckle scan on the other side. For more detailed instructions, see our guide for full arch scanning.